Oh man. Last episode of Minecraft Hardcore was a great success. We are very quickly approaching end game. And by end game, I mean like end end game, as in completing Minecraft forever, which is actually insane. I actually completely forgot, because I haven't logged into this world for at least a few days, that we moved these beacons. And it actually looks awesome, but the only problem is I did completely rinse out the rest of my iron from my iron farm. So what I need to do is wait for this to replenish before I can add a fourth beacon. And to get a fourth beacon in the first place, I need three more wither skulls. And last time, that took me at least two hours. So I'm definitely not going to be doing that in quite a hurry, but we do need it for one of the advancements. There have every potion effect applied at the same time. I think that's going to help me with that because when you bring up this, I can already have some of these active. I don't need a potion for every single one. Anyway, today what I want to do is work on something we haven't done yet, which is grabbing a trident because I mentioned to you guys that I am going to want to get some skeleton horses. I don't know. I'm on the fence about changing buddy and slow horse into skeleton horses because I don't know if I want to do that to them. Regardless, we're going to employ some new horses in the future and turn them into skeleton horses. The best way to do that is to get a trident with channeling and when it rains, you can zap horses into skeleton horses. I believe that's the case because when a channeling trident hits the ground when it's raining, it creates lightning. So we are going to do that very soon. We're not doing that today. Today, we need to grab the tridents. The problem is I don't really know where to get them from. I think the best thing I'm going to be able to do, which is good right now, actually, is going to fly around the ocean until I get hit by one of the, um, what are they called? The drowned. You get them from the drowned. <laughs> so we're going to make our way over to there. Um, what was I going to do? I was going to fly away. Okay, that definitely didn't work. There we go. That's better. To the ocean! We can actually do this now. This is so cool. Oh, I love having these wings. Last time we learned how to fly, we made ourselves an elytra helipad so we can land there without dying. Do still need to be careful, though. I'm always going to have a totem of undying just chilling in my inventory because if I die, I'll be so dead. The whole thing will be over. And I'm, I'm this close to being able to complete Minecraft. It's crazy. Right. I also need to figure out if I can get some more gunpowder at some point. But today, I want to get a trident and then try and get the enchantments on it that we need. We need mending, loyalty, and we also need channeling, which is the last one that we need for our lightning to happen. So I think the best place to go, because I don't think my farm is going to work, I think the best place to go is over here. Just in a flat area. Actually, I've heard somewhere that a river is good. That a river is really good for spawning in the drowned. Let's see. Going down. <laughs> oh, you're deep. Oh, my goodness. Right, we just need to wait for drowns now. I probably should have uh, brought a boat with me. But you know what? I don't have one. I just need drowned to come and attack me. Oh, wait. This could be good. This could be very good for spawning in drowned. I think I need a flat area. I was going to make a whole farm for them, but I only need one trident. And I don't need one with the enchantment on it. I don't even know if you can get that. But I just want some drowned to come and get me. Look at me. I don't know quite what I'm doing here, but I'm stuck in the ocean. Someone come and save me. And then I'll take your life and take your trident. What is happening here? I'm not sure about this. This is weird. Definitely should have made a boat. There we go. Right, Totem of Undying. Let's see if I can boss this. I need to be so careful. I need to land gracefully. Oh my goodness, there's mobs everywhere. I'm going to die here, aren't I? This is going to be awful. Right, let's land gracefully. Oh! <laughs> Ow! I was too busy laughing. Ah, no! Oh my goodness, I'm not wearing my chest plate. How did that happen? I wasn't even touching the forward button. And I was like flying across the surface. That was amazing. Oh, wait, I'm going back towards where I was before. Where do drowns spawn? I heard they just spawn randomly. I need them to spawn here. I need a trident dweller, please. Maybe I should go to a different biome. Let's go to a bigger ocean. Let's do it. Here we go. Oh, I always feel amazing when I do this. Look, fired all the way to the top of the world. Let's go. I'm going to run out of rockets pretty quickly, so we are going to need to farm creepers at some point. But not today. Today is all about the drowned and getting me that trident. Because not only do you need to find ones that have a trident, but you also need to find ones that will drop the trident. It's only a, um, I think it's only like an 11% chance if they have one. Hold up. Hold up. There he is. What's good, bro? I saw you from out here. You got any friends with a trident? I would really, really like one. Um, oh, 
Oh, this is a perfect place to spawn. Oh, yeah, we got some. There he is. There's one with a trident right there. Okay, I need to get out of this. I need to put this on. He's genuinely got one. Right, okay. This is out. This is a good place. Stop that right now. Give me your trident, buddy. This is what I wanted. It's exactly what I wanted. You know what? You can hit me with it all you like. Just drop it when you die. Did, did you drop it when you died? I don't think you... Oh, you dropped gold? You actually dropped gold. You didn't drop it, did you? You little punk! Hey! I'll take it out on you. Please find me a guy that has a trident that he's willing to drop. There was... I think it landed down here, actually. But I don't know if it works like that. Is it down here? Oh, it is. Can I, can I grab this? Can I grab this? I want it. Gimme. I want the trident, please. Oh, I'm gonna die. Help. Help me right now, please. <gasps> I'm going crazy. I don't think I can pick it up from here. That would be good, but I don't think it's going to happen. But if it did, I wouldn't be mad. Surely you could just rip this out the floor. Okay, I think it might have gone now. Where did the trident go? I'm not going to die for it. I'm not that into it. <laughs> oh, I'm actually really low. Woo! Okay, please don't die. Do not die for the trident. It's not worth it. So I guess the plan is either fly around for a dra- Oh, someone just threw one at me. Oh, where are you? There you are. They are spawning here. This is where I should have built my original, um, my original base. All right, come here, you. There we go. Drop it. You didn't drop it! For goodness sake! I didn't realize the tridents were so hard to get. It's actually hard enough to find one, a, a drown spawned in the wild with one in the first place. But with looting three, there's like an 11 point something percent chance of them even dropping it. It's crazy. But yeah, this was a, this would have been a good place to build my original farm. Because it looks like drowned a spawn in here. I just need one that's got a trident and then feels like dropping it. Um, yeah, this is going to take a while. <laughs> it's out in an ocean, lost, scared and alone. Do they spawn more often near these things? I feel like they do. Normally, they're like packed with them in here. Is there actually uh, anything in here? Hello, there it is. Wow. Buried treasure map and some coal. Don't mind if I do. You know what? I think I'm going to put on my... Oh, jeez. My Elytra wings are going to die. Oh, I need to kill some stuff. Desperately. Oh, dude. I didn't even realize. I've got mending, but I completely forgot that I actually need to collect experience for it to work. Sorry, guys. You're going to have to go down. I need your experience. Don't you... Don't you swim away from me, please. There we go. Repair my wings, boys. Okay, night one, extremely unsuccessful. And now I think that my uh, my stuff is going to break. It's not a good start, is it? Let's see if these guys want to play. How's it going, guys? I just want to take your experience, please. That's all I need. It's going to go into my sword first, isn't it? You need to be careful about these things. There we go. I do have an XP farm at home, though, so no worries. I have an elytra, and I'm walking. This isn't what it was made for. So I'm going to just quickly use one more boost. It should survive that long and fly to my XP farm. I'm going to go out on a limb and say I've read somewhere. I'm not sure where it is, but I've read... Oh, my goodness, that was close. Oh, my goodness, I almost broke it. Look at that. That's so close. Oh, if I lose the Elytra, I will be so mad at myself. It is unreal. This has probably stopped working as well, hasn't it? Yep, you're like the worst employee ever. You just think you, you do what you want, basically, don't you? Right, what we got here? Let's see how much this will give us back. Wings. I just want to make sure that this is all working. What is happening? <laughs> Everything's broke. Right, let's take this out. And I repaired them fully. Okay, never mind. Great, carry on what you're doing. <laughs> Right, that's now fully repaired. That is good. I now need to wait until sunset, which is super annoying. The only other way you can get drowned is by flooding a spawner. But I don't think there's an easy way to do that. And I don't think that spawns in the ones with the tridents either. So I need to wait around like a river or something like that to be able to get more drowned spawns. So I only saw three. Luckily, two of them had tridents. But if I'm going to get this trident today, I need for this to work way better. Let me see what biome this is. This biome is, yeah, just a normal river. I think they might spawn here, you know. Right, I just need to wait till night time. Fun. I've been sitting in this boat for about I was gonna say, yeah, that's a lie. I've been sitting here for about 20 minutes. It's probably not even 20 minutes, but it felt like it. Ready to get smacked by some drowns. I just need it to happen. I built a boat. That's what I spent my last 10 minutes doing. How did I just hurt myself? <laughs> As the moon rises, so do the drowns. Hit me with your best shot, boys. I'm ready for it. Can I just fly around and see them like I did before? I feel like they'd already like pre-spawned in. 
I'm at least going to try it for a little bit because I need something to make this faster. I need a trident and I need one bad. Ah, wait. This could be it. Look how many drowned are here. Yo, I think we found it. I think we found the place to be. There's five here. It's near these structures. I knew it. I knew there was a place near here. That, uh, there's a trident boy. Come on. Trident boy, please. Ah, I wasn't meant to do that. I was trying to use my shield, but I don't have one. Oh, jeez, I'm drowning now. Okay, this is bad. This is really bad. Oh, no. Okay, Um, I need to change clothes real quick. Put this on. Get you out of here. You're, you're not a drowned boy. I just want the drowned boys. Where is he? There he is. Come on, give me this trident. I deserve it. You know I deserve it. Why won't you drop it? There's definitely way more of them spawning down here, though. On these little monuments. If I had a banner, I could have marked it, but I don't have one on me. Look, these tridents are just mocking me. You should just be able to grab them. Give me. Give me this. This is rightfully mine now. I killed your owner, so this is mine. It even moves through the air and I just can't get it. Come on, don't be mean. Wait, what is that? What is that skeleton? And since when do they spawn in? Where did that come from? I have never seen one of these spawn before. Look at it. It's only in an ice biome. That's crazy. Look at this thing. What is that? Yo, I have never seen one of these things before. And now he's fighting the spider. Can you just chill? No, I want, I want, to, I want to attack him. Stop. I want him. He's mine. Look at this dude. Monsters hunted. <gasps> Wait, did I just complete the achievement where I killed every monster? No. Kill one of every hostile monster. You have to be joking. I did not think I would have completed that right now. That's sick. I've never seen one of them before. And I've just spotted an igloo up here as well that I kind of want to check out. But I, I really need to see more drowned. Like desperate. Look at this igloo. Is this rare as well? Where am I? An alternate dimension? I think they only spawn over here. Look at them. They've got like weird clothes and special enchanted rods. Now, last time I was in one of these. Ah! <sighs> you told me to go underneath. There we go. Secret passageway. Let's go. Oh, please, Minecraft. Sort me out. Stop. Oh, I thought I was going to die then. But yeah, last time I saw one of these, I didn't know there was a weird secret tunnel underneath the carpet. But hey. Oh. I see what's going on here. It's giving me everything I need to be able to heal this guy. That's so cool. Whoa. I can't trade with you, obviously. I can't trade with you, but it's given me the stuff to be able to fix you. You know what? It'd be rude if I didn't, wouldn't it? Let's just do it. I've got a golden apple to spare because I just found one here. So let me splash this guy real quick. And then I can heal him, right? Yeah. I didn't know this was a thing. It just has a ready-made healing thing ready to go. That's so cool. And I've got some stones that I can... What is going on here? Are these silverfish things as well? I didn't know these could be silverfish things. I'm learning so much. Just taking your bricks real quick. I don't think you'd mind. Wait, I'm actually low-key wasting the night time right here. And I haven't got a lot of time. So hopefully by the time we get back downstairs, this dude has been healed and give me cheap stuff. Oh, geez. No, no, no. Stay away from me. I need drowned. Give me a trident. It's unreal that I still don't have one. Spawn. Now. Let me see if I can turn this guy into a drowned. Because apparently, if they get submerged for a long enough amount of time, because they can't really swim, he'll turn into a drowned. But I don't know if he'll turn into a drowned with a trident. I just want to see. I think it takes them 30 seconds to change. But if he can spawn with a trident, I just need to bop zombies into the water. But I don't think he can. He definitely can't get out, though. Poor guy. You mad? Oh, oh he's shaking. He's shaking. It's happening. I've transformed one zombie into a, a normal villager. Now I'm transforming a zombie into a drowned. I'm doing science over here, guys. Big boy science. Hey, there we go. Didn't change into what I wanted, though. So you're going to have to go. Sorry, lads. Bye. Let's get back to our little science experiment over here. How's it going? How are you doing? You're still not healed yet? It doesn't take that long. I like how it has like the uh, the arrows as well to tell you what to do. That's kind of cool. Oh, are you kidding me? He turned into a nitwit. Nitwits have no jobs. You guys both suck. Oh, jeez. I can't believe it. Oh. Oh, he's got a fishing rod. I just got clickbaited. My goodness. You know how hard these guys are to get to spawn? And you give me a fishing rod. And he dropped the fishing rod. God, that guy just made me so mad. It has been out. 
It has been an entire week and I haven't really played Minecraft that much because this took so long. But now I've got a very small boy trying to hit me with a trident. And I've also found a better location for this. So let's try and figure out how we're going to try and take this guy out. This better be the one. I have killed probably about 10 trident holders and none of them have worked. So I'm hoping this small boy will drop it. I don't think he dropped it. Why? <laughs> Why is this so hard to get? But now, basically, I am in a uh, deep ocean biome with not much land around because before there was way too much land around and other things could spawn. Whereas now, all we've got is basically drowns spawning in and fish. So there's much more. See, look. There's way more drown spawning in. So I'm going to try and chop these guys down until daytime. We've still got a little bit of time left. I've also got a Nautilus shell from this, which is pretty nice. So I can make another conduit very, very soon. I definitely didn't get it, did I? No, my Elytra as well is <laughs> almost dead. I'm in, a, I'm in a mess, but I will get this trident. I need it. I also know that after this grind in getting the trident in the first place, I then need to grind out the uh, the mending enchantments and the loyalty enchantments from our villagers. So it's going to be a little bit of a grind, but when we've got it, it's going to be so worth it. So here's another one. Doesn't have a trident though. Come on, tell your friends to bring the tridents with them, please. Baby drowned with a trident is actually pretty rare in itself because they only have a small chance to spawn with one. They only have a small chance to be a baby one in the first place, so... That was pretty lucky. Unfortunately, we weren't lucky enough to get the trident from him. Oh, hold on. We've got a lot of them here, but I don't think any of them are holding a trident. He's got an enchanted fishing rod, which is pretty crazy. This guy's got a normal one. Oh, I told you. See, look, we've got lots of them. Ow. Ow. Oh, I thought someone was throwing something at me. Oh, someone is throwing something at me. One of them's got a trident. It's this guy. Okay, you need to go. Like, straight away. Give me your trident. This is mine. I don't think it dropped the trident still. The trident is so rare, man. So rare. Look how many there are. This is definitely a better place to be. I don't want to die here either. Oh, still no trident. I killed so many. Oh, there's a guy right underneath me. I didn't know he was going to spawn. Come here, you. Yes. Come on, be the, be the last one. You're the last one alive. Give me it. Okay, don't. Never mind. <laughs> the sun sets. On another day of trying to get this stupid trident. You don't bring me one, you die. This is going to drive me crazy. I feel like this is the longest I've grinded for something in this whole Let's Play. And it's like one of the last things we need as well. Hey, look, this guy has a Nautilus shell. This is how I got my other one. Uh, I don't know if it drops every time, but I'd sure love it if... <laughs> Where did that chicken come from? Give me that. It does drop every time. Why doesn't the trident drop every time? That's so mean. What are you doing here? Why are you out in the ocean all by yourself? Are you okay? I feel like I should take you home, but I kind of can't. I'm busy at the moment. Trident. All I want is a trident. So I think the Nautilus shell is every time. But the trident just ain't dropping for me. Someone's throwing something at me. There it is. I was like, I'm sure I can hear one. This guy hits so hard as well. Do not die to thorns. Come on. I have been here for days. Another day has passed. Oh my goodness, it's still not there. Look, it's daytime again. <laughs> so the odds of getting one with looting three uh, from a trident bearer is like 11%. I've definitely killed more than 10, which should be enough when it comes down to like probability and stuff. You should need to kill just under 10 to be able to get one trident. Yeah, that ain't, that ain't working for me. Another challenger approaches. How's it going, bro? You gonna drop it for me? You feeling nice? Looting three! Yeah, I don't think that works anymore. Come on, I know you're not gonna drop it for me. But I thought I'd at least try. Here we go. No, yet again. Come on, come on. Jeez! It's kind of a joke now. I've killed at least 20. Just to put this all into perspective, while we're uh, floating here in the ocean, the gold ingots, which I currently have seven of, only have an 8% drop chance from drowned. That's right, and I have how many of them? Seven. That's crazy. There's only a 6.25% chance of the drowned even spawning in with a trident, and then it's 11 from that. I might cry. Okay, hold on a second. I need to get these guys out of here. Oh, jeez. No, this isn't going well. I need them to not die from thorns. There's oh my goodness, there's loads. <gasps> Did I get one? I just got one. I just got one. I actually just got one. Yeah, there it is. It's got unbreaking two on it already as well. I don't need your... Oh, no. Okay, this is bad. Um, 
Yeah, I'm in trouble here. Where did all you guys come from, huh? Well, I need to quickly change clothes. Now, I'm ready for you. If I get two, I'm going to be so mad. He broke my attack. I, <laughs> I just got two in a row. I don't believe it. Oh, my goodness. Get out of here. You will suck. You drive me insane. I got two. In the end, I actually got two. In the daytime as well. What can I drop? Let's get rid of... We don't need iron nuggets. Oh, man. I actually got a decent one, too. Look, check this out. I'm breaking two trident and a normal one. I can combine those. And it has been so long out here that at the beginning, you saw my elytra was pretty much dead. Now, it's pretty much healed. So I need to get out of here. This drives me insane. All right, then, fireworks. Take me up, up, and away. Oh, we finally got one. Not just one, but two in a row. That is actually unreal. You know what? Our patience paid off because we got one with unbreaking on. That's pretty, that's pretty good. That's better than getting a normal one. And it had three quarters of the durability. So that was pretty unlucky. But now we need to go and get mending on it, which we can definitely do. But then we need to roll channeling so that we can try and get, uh, oh, we need loyalty as well. We need a few enchantments. Luckily, I got some villagers. Yeah, here it is. Home sweet home. I have been in the ocean for so long <laughs> that I forgot what this looked like. Oh, unnamed doggo, it has been so long. I recorded the first half of this episode over a week ago, so I actually have no idea what I've done today. Regardless, let's get rid of all this rotten flesh. Oh, man, I'm just going to throw some of this away. I think I can trade it, actually. I can trade all this stuff. Let's get rid of the snow. So we need these emeralds, and we also need... Um, I think we need books as well. Yeah, we're going to need some books just to get the mending. We're also going to need a... What's it called? The table with a book. A lectern. I think that's it, actually. I think that's all we're going to need. Actually, let's combine these first. So we can combine this and this. And it makes, well, it's not that great, but we also need to think of a name for the trident. We combine two. Now we need channeling, because remember, the reason we're doing this, you'd have heard this already, but I only said this a week ago. The reason we're doing this is to get skeleton horses, because in the rain, if you throw a trident with channeling, it zaps the ground with lightning. It, like, summons lightning, and if you zap a horse with lightning, it creates a skeleton horse. So that's the plan. The hard bit is done. Now we've got to roll for the right enchantments too. Loyalty and channeling. I've already got mending. Let's go and grab that as we glide to the grounds. Whoa, whoa. That was awkward. All right, open sesame. Where's my mending boy? Where you at? Ten emeralds and a book. That ain't too shabby. All right then, friend. Thank you for mending. He's already... He's actually only a novice still. That's crazy. Pleasure doing business with you, sir. Right now, we need to turn these two into the right people. So, knockback. That is not what we need. So, I need to keep on re-rolling this over and over again so that you can get the right enchantment. How did you turn into a leather worker? So, doing this over and over again. Efficiency 5? I've already got that. Never mind. I was going to say, that's a pretty good one, though. So, every time I do this, this guy will re-roll. Oh, Riptide. Riptide's for a, um, for a trident, but that involves it being able to uh, make you fly through the air, which is pretty cool, but is very, very dangerous in a uh, hardcore. So, I am not going to be doing that. Channeling. Oh, I got it. Channeling. That's a good one. Okay, that and that. Gives me channeling. Sweet. So this guy is now locked in, which is annoying. But this guy has decided to turn into a librarian. So we can make it so that this guy has loyalty. So channeling and loyalty are the ones that I need. It's already got mending. And then I just need to combine them all. And then we're good. I have run out of emeralds, though, which is a slight problem. Let me just go and trade my man some paper. So I actually have the emeralds to be able to trade with him when he creates the trade. Otherwise, that would be super awkward. Really awkward, actually. The channeling was pretty cheap, actually. Uh, I need to trade all of this with you. How many are you going to give me, though? Eight, nine. Okay, that's not too bad, and he's still got space. Now I just need to keep re-rolling this over and over again to be able to get the right one. But he's not changing jobs. Change! Come on, you nitwit. Wait, 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 wait. Did you hear that? Oh, what are you doing here? No, 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 no. Okay, you need to go. Actually, I'm just going to leave them alone. I'm not even going to bother them. Just leave leave me alone and nothing bad will happen to you, okay? Let's just block ourselves in. Oh, no. <laughs> Why now? Loyalty three. Oh, 29 emeralds, though. 
Um, I need to be right back. I'm going to go and sell my soul. So the higher the level of loyalty, the faster the speed at which it will return to you. So a loyalty one is obviously still going to work fine. But, oh man, that's actually too good not to do. So I need to make sure that he doesn't lose that, which means I need to do some trading pretty desperately. Right, let us make as much paper as we can carry. This guy is going to give me so many emeralds. How many did I need? 29? He ain't going to give me that much. <laughs> How are you? Take my take my paper. Just please don't run out. I'll be so mad. Oh, he just ran out. How many have I got? 25? What else do you want from me? Glass panes and a compass. Coal equals emeralds. That's easy. Okay, I'm going to get coal. And I'm going to get... What was the other thing? Glass panes. Coal. Oh, baby. That's right. I got so much coal. I am back for your wares. Take all of this. Take all of it. I don't need any of it. He's not even going to take it all. Now, I can go my, get my channeling... No, my loyalty book. And lock this bad boy in. Please don't have changed. Please don't have changed. Yes. Dang, I need a book. <laughs> I can't believe I forgot the most crucial ingredient. Right, grab a book. And then I can enchant this bad boy because I still have 62 levels, which is crazy. I pretty much got unlimited enchantments. Oh, right, here we go. Trade of the century. How's it going, buddy? Still got loyalty. I will take one of your books. Thank you very much. Pleasure doing business with you guys. I will move you out very, very shortly. But for now, I need to combine these and actually test out my trident. So this better not break. Doesn't really matter. So we've got unbreaking, and then we add loyalty to it. Sweet. Then we've also got mending and channeling as well. I don't know if you can add sharpness to it. I'm not sure what else you could do. Uh, mending is five, and then channeling is 11. What should we... We need to name it something. Uh, we're just going to name it Timmy. That's what we're going to call it. Timmy Trident. Oh, buddy. We got it. I'm so pleased. Look at us now. We're proper endgame Minecraft now. Right now... We need to test this on something. And since it's not nighttime, something's going to die. This sheep right here. <laughs> I've never used a trident before. Oh, my goodness. Sheep, you need to die. It doesn't go far enough. It does come back really quickly, actually. Uh, whoa. A throwaway joke. Throw a trident at something. <laughs> what is the other advancement for that? There's definitely another one. Strike a villager with lightning. Well, I can only summon lightning when it's raining. So I need to figure that out. I also need to figure out how... I think I can put sharpness on it. I feel like I can. Oh, maybe you can't. It's impaling and that's it. So our next challenge is to literally wait until it rains. And then we can create our skeleton horses. We've got a skeleton doggo, but now... We can have ourselves a skeleton horse. And I don't know about you, but I'm excited. That took so long. Timmy's here. <laughs> Timmy the Trident, let's go. <laughs> How far can you throw this thing? I'm going to make it go all the way up here. This is probably a terrible idea. Yeah, that's far. And it should come back. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, that's so good. We got the best loyalty as well. The, the rolls for the enchantments actually made up for the fact that it took ages to get the trident in the first place. It really did. Oh, jeez. How did you end up in there? Dude, this goes so far. <laughs> I finally got one. My good... Oh, I thought it hit a cactus. Oh, if it hit a cactus and deleted, I'd be... I'd be so upset. Right, before I lose this thing, let's end out the video. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Let's leave a like for the Trident. This took me like a week to get. It's crazy. So unlucky. But we got it. It's fully enchanted to the max. Let me know if there's any other enchantments I should put on it. Interesting that it doesn't actually glow with enchantments. I feel like it should. But yeah, let me know if there's something we can put on it to make it more strong because it didn't kill that pig in one shot. But next up, we wait for rain and we start zapping things with lightning. Increase our advancement and we're pretty close to completing the entirety of Minecraft. Guys, thank you so much for watching. This was a very painful episode to record. So thank you so much for joining me on this journey. If you did enjoy, then please do leave a like, subscribe using that button, that big red button underneath the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. And I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye. Wagon, candle, canvas, sofa, fork, rubber band.